you remember these scenes from my first video about kayaking and I promised you to tell you something about my boats. I want to tell you why this inflatable kayak is so strong and so reliable in rough waters. First, it is the backbone that makes an advanced frame as sturdy as a solid kayak. Example given, the Advanced Elements Advanced Frame Expedition, a kayak of 13 feet or nearly 4 meters of total length, needs a backbone of an overall length of 9 feet and 6 inch or 2.90 meters. The backbone is special equipment you have to pay for with extra money, however, you should pay. The very simple but very robust construction makes it easy for you to mount the backbone. The backbone itself is an aluminium pipe of 1.5 mm thickness and a diameter of 30 mm. This pipe is coated with 6 mm of foam. When mounted with a simple click, the pieces overlap with a depth of 80 mm. The solid shovels that keep the backbone in position are made of plastic. You need to assemble one of the shovels and a third of the pipe for the back, the other shovel and two thirds of the pipe for the front and put them into the boat after pumping a little bit of air into the tube, only to model the boat a little bit, however, without pressure. Then you complete the backbone, bring the shovels in position above keel and under the surrounding tube and put the inflatable floor into the boat. After inflating the tube, the boat is absolutely safe and solid. The inflatable floor does not carry the boat. You should not forget to oil the plug connections of the backbone with Vaseline. Connecting the dry metal into metal, you will learn to know what desperation is when after a tour you try to unmount the backbone. Vaseline is not too liquid when the summer is hot and viscous enough when temperatures are around 0 degrees Celsius. Further on and second that makes this inflatable boat being a real boat are the aluminium ribs in the bow and stern. They fix the outer skin of the boat so that an advanced frame really slices through the waterline. It does not stamp on the waves like many other rubber dinghies. Third, that makes these kayaks of the production line advanced frames so easygoing, good natured, and uncomplicated is the flat undersurface and the flat keel over nearly the complete length. It seems not to be like that when the boat is ready to start. However, on the water and under weight, the outer skin of the boat is pressed under the inflatable floor and, if you use one, under the backbone. So, the undersurface of an advanced frame kayak or expedition or convertible is shaped with a flat undersurface and a clear and strong keel. So, you can see that the developers of advanced elements do understand the evolution of building ships. They do understand how to make a boat fast and at the same time good tempered and safe. They do understand to put all these good characters to an inflatable kayak.
so far for now. My name is Gerhard Ochsenfeld. Enjoy some more impressions and enjoy with me to pedal towards the wind. This day presented nice waves at winds of 5 up to 6 units on Beaufort scale. Thank you for watching and goodbye.